I'm here at Wild Horse Disc Golf Club with my friend Bobcat, Bob Buckley, my new friend Nick, and Santos. We're going to be playing, reviewing the course. Enjoy. Give me the finer points of cart golf with disc golf. It's pretty sweet. Look at this. Comes with the greens fees. Outstanding. So what are some of your goals now that you're playing full-time pro disc golf? Um, play better. <laughs> um, a solid goal. Working my putting. Um, I want, I, like I'm fully content with donating all season just to take a, a lesson from all the pros. I'd really like to um, cash in a tournament this year. That's like my like beginner goal. Kind of want to make it up to 950 rated. That's another one of my goals. Outstanding. What's your favorite hole on this course? Uh, on this course we're playing? Yeah. Um, oh, probably, I think it's one coming up next. It's a par four. If you land on the right hand side, there's no footing. Um, so I try to aim for the left hand side. All the pros just clear the bad footing, but I don't have that distance. So. <laughs> Nice shot. Nice. 
tapping in the deuce. Nice shot. What was your best memory from the uh, the tournament you guys just played? Um, mine was a birdie on end of a three. Yeah, I had practiced that a lot and uh, never even got close. And I parked it within like three or four feet. So getting a birdie out here was amazing for me. Probably all the people. Uh recently moved out of the state so getting to hang out with all the people back home again and hang out all week has been uh, fun doing something that we all enjoy excellent and he finally got to meet me <laughs> that's a win all day it's the best part of my trip so far uh, favorite member was probably watching uh, two of my better friends out here uh, crush the tournament and place very well um, which I played better myself but watching them succeed is always good Western New York representation. Nice roll. Under hole 13, normally a par five, but the morning course is a uh, abbreviated version. I just made a, the best putt of my day and didn't film it. And, uh, disgusting. This course is awesome.
Lincoln Santos, you have a uh, favorite hole on this course? I gotta say mine was 18 on uh, infinite, over the water, both sides. Oh, it's a great one. On Innova, Innova 18 from the challenge. Sweet. Yeah. You have one? You want Innova, to add? Innova Hole 18 has to be the best hole on the property. Uh, 18 at Innova was probably the best. Yeah, for sure. There you go. Get in. Well inbound, easily. Line drive. It's a little long. So I hit the pin with a forehand approach shot, stood up and rolled all the way down by this tree. Shot. So we're in the back half of things now and uh, still having a good time. My only complaint about this course is it's hard to navigate. I'm really thankful to have uh, my friends with me because there's no way I was going to find this without them.
Oh, oh no. Playing safe. Oh! So this is the basket location from uh, Bobcat's ace in practice. What was the shot for the ace? Uh, it was a forehand skip shot. It hit my Melissa Pro. This guy. Nope. One of these guys over here. Maybe it's still in my bag. Hit the top and hit the chains. It was blocked by this palm tree, so it was blind, so we couldn't see it. So Justin Gilbert actually ran all the way up to see if it was in the basket, and then he started dancing because it was in. Nice. You go long, long right. Looks like it's gonna work. Flip over, flip over. You hit the tractor. Oh, bank shot. On to our final hole. Thanks again, guys, for bringing me along, for coming along. Absolutely. Appreciate the tour. Good round, guys. Oh, he got down. It's going left now. You should see it now. Rolling back to, towards you. Towards the left. Oh, 